Today, I'm going to be comparing two tablets just through benchmark results. Uh, I don't own the Galaxy Tab A8 over here. I don't own it, but I do own a Fire Max 11, which I was able to do benchmark scores for. Um, I found out that for... So when I ran Geekbench 5 for the CPU, I came back with a bench mark score of 704 versus 2000 for multi-core, single core versus multi-core. And I was able to find uh, numbers for the Samsung A8 and it showed uh, 386 and 1443. Actually, even just to start this, um, it seems like the Fire Max 11 is both a faster uh, tablet than an A8 as well as uh, in terms of computation as well as graphics so first so CPU wise as well as graphics wise this seems to be the Fire Max 11 a, a, a better performing tablet than the Samsung Tab A8 um, this is just through benchmark results um, again I showed you Geekmark Geekbench 5 results and this is just for the CPU Um, better single core, uh, 386 versus 704, that's single core and multi-core, 1443 versus 2000, and the 2000 is the Fire Max 11. Uh, now in terms of graphics, I ran the uh, 3D Mark Wildlife test and had an overall score of 1096 versus 714. 6.6 .6 frames per second versus four frames per second. Higher number of frames is better. And so you can see that the Fire Max 11, it's a, a year or two newer and it shows. So uh, for those who are considering getting a Samsung Tab A8 versus the Fire Max, Fire Max 11. Long story short, based on benchmarks, it seems like this is the faster tablet. Of course, you have to deal with Fire OS user interface versus uh, Samsung's user interface, so that's a different story.